Hey everybody, welcome back to round two of the water comparison video series. Today we're doing a comparison of all five of these bottles of water. And what all five of these have in common is these are all sparkling waters. Normally sparkling waters do not make it to round two, but all of these made it because in round one, these were each up against another sparkling water. So they all had to make it here because they were all sparkling. And so at the end of this video, one of these is going to make it to round three, that's going to be the first time ever that a sparkling water makes it to round three of my comparison series. So let's just take a look at them. First up is Dasani Sparkling Black Cherry Flavored Water. Next up is Pure Aqua Black Cherry Flavor also. Next up is Aquafina Black Cherry Dragon Fruit. So apparently I really like the flavor Black Cherry because all three of these are Black Cherry. Next up is Voss Water. This is flavorless. This is just sparkling water with no flavor. This is water from Norway, and it's in a glass bottle. I think this is an awesome designed bottle. But this review is just focusing on the taste and the flavor. Next up is LaCroix Coconut Water. I think there was not a, a black cherry option. There were like 10 LaCroix that I was reviewing. And um, I had to buy these in a case for each flavor. So I've been drinking a lot of LaCroix La uh, lately. Just um, when I'm not doing the videos. So let's just open these up and start doing a comparison. The two like main ones that I think people are going to be interested in is Aquafina and Dasani. Because these are like direct competitors with each other. Aquafina is made by Pepsi. Dasani is made by Coke. I did a review of Aquafina and Asani against each other as as uh, Stillwaters, and that video gets um, a lot of rewatches, new comments, and stuff. And as you see, like the bottles or the cans themselves look very similar. They're obviously influenced by each other, but there's different ingredients. These are not the same ingredients. Aquafina actually has ten calories. The Sony has none. So. Let's just open them up and do a um, comparison. Another neat little difference is Aquafina has different flavors, and each of their flavors has a different tab indicating which flavor it is. Dasani does not do that. So I think Aquafina's can is actually cooler. Okay, so here we go. Here's the real thing. Let's open these up and do the review. Dasani. I can taste the cherry there. Smell a little bit of cherry there too. Uh oh. Shoot, 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 shoot. Ah, it's really good. There's a much stronger taste of cherry in this one than Sony. This one is similar to Dasani though in that it does not have any calories. This has no calories, no fat, no sodium, no carbs, no protein, no sugar. So how the heck do they get the flavor in there? It says there's just like citric acid and stuff but it says it contains no juice. So how do they get the flavor so strong in this? There's no calories, no sodium. It's crazy. Very good. Here's Aquafina. Yeah, it's it's very very weak flavored compared to this one. So it's it's weird. This one has calories, this one has sodium, this one has carbs, this one has sugar, but this one tastes, like, more strong. If This one tastes, the Aldi bottle tastes a lot more sugary, but it doesn't have sugar in it. It's crazy. Like, this tastes like 
like a cherry Coke. It's, it's crazy. How do they do that when there's no, like, carbs or, or calories or anything? It's... Okay, here's Voss. I think there's a lot of carbonation in this one. Because this one, like, sort of burns your tongue going down. I mean, I mean, your throat, not, not your tongue. It kind of, like, burns my lips, too. Must be the most carbonated out of all these. So if you, like, shake these up, they kind of explode, you know, when you open them. So I'm kind of curious how they get this all the way from Norway without shaking it up in, in like, the container ship. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, here's LaCroix. <laughs> LaCroix is apparently the best or one of the best-selling um, sparkling waters out there today. Yeah, getting the, the coconut flavor. Um, this one also has zero calories, zero carbs, zero sugar. And I, it's interesting. I would even say this one has a stronger flavor than than Aquafina. And Aquafina has the, the calories and carbs and sugar and stuff. Yeah, this is a good one. I'm glad I picked this out of the other LaCroix. Like I was saying, I've been drinking a lot of a lot of LaCroix lately because I bought so much of it for that review of it. And something I've noticed is LaCroix tastes better when it's refrigerated. I think most sparkling waters taste better when they're refrigerated. Um, but for this review, I'm, they're not refrigerated because that would be unfair to my other reviews where I'd never refrigerate them. Okay. The first one out is the Voss water because it just tastes, like, bad. The only reason this made this to this round is because it was up against other flavors of Voss water, which also just tasted bad. I think this might be the most expensive out of all of these, and it's the most good-looking bottle. I love the design of this bottle. I feel bad just throwing this out. I'm, I might have to find a use for this bottle. But, as far as the flavor goes, this is the worst. So it's out. pretty easy. Next one out is Aquafina. The, I mean, the review is just, like, the main main part of the review is just the taste. And I think this, this has the most, like, mild taste, like, which is not very strong, um, you know, flavor to it. But on top of that, how does it have the weakest taste out of these four? And it has the most calories in it. This is going to be a long video, because normally I would just chug this all at once. But I can't do that with sparkling waters. It's just tougher. is out. Okay. And if you, again, if this is your first time watching my videos, 
I don't like sparkling waters. I would never normally buy them. The only reason I'm doing this video is because I haven't done these these bottles yet, or these cans yet. I feel like so gassy. I hate sparkling waters. I feel I have to like burp for 10 seconds in a row. Okay. Next I'm going to say Dasani is out. And then LaCroix is out. So the winner is Pure Aqua. And this, I don't even remember the, the prices, but I think this is the cheapest out of all five of these. It's definitely the cheapest, like, per fluid ounce. Another interesting thing is, this bottle was up against three other Aldi sparkling waters. And they were different prices. And this was the cheaper one out of those four. So, I mean, sometimes price makes a difference, but in this case it does not. Because this one just tastes the best. Uh, if you're ever at Ollie, check this out if, if, you, if you like uh, sparkling waters. Pretty similar to like a Cherry Coke. <laughs> and so, John Drinks Water is a series where I drink a bottle of water in every video. And it's kind of debatable whether these flavored sparkling waters are really water. So, I'm going to finish the video by drinking a regular bottle of water. So, here we go.